Hey yogis, welcome to my channel. My name is Kristen and today's yoga practice is all about relieving stress. So we'll work to kind of move the body around, stretch things out, releasing any stress from a physical perspective, but then hopefully also just by getting some energy shifting and the breath flowing, we'll be able to release uh, mentally and emotionally as well. No props needed for this class. Go ahead and roll out your yoga mat and we're gonna get started in a comfortable seat. And as you make your way into that seat, you can close down your eyes, rest your hands down in your lap, turning your palms to face down and just start to get really grounded here. Feel the earth beneath you Noticing the surface that you're sitting on. Noticing a sense of heaviness in your feet, your legs, your hips. Feeling your hands rest on your lap. And letting your shoulders kind of soften down away from your ears. Let your heart lift slightly. Find a little bit of lightness there. Find a gentle stretch or a pull upwards through the crown of your head. And allow your belly to soften as you let your spine stay nice and alert. And then just take a moment here to notice the rise and fall of your breath. Maybe noticing where in your body you feel your breath the most. Noticing the texture of your breath, the quality of your breath. And if you notice that it might be kind of short, maybe a little choppy, then maybe you just start to deepen the breath ever so slightly. Start to steady it out and really smooth out any of the jagged little edges. You might also notice any intrusive thoughts, any feelings that arise, but I invite you to, invite you to let go of any judgment, any expectation, or any attachment to these thoughts and feelings, just really allowing yourself to be more of the witness to your experience. Knowing that just as these things come in, they can also go out. And then just continuing to breathe here. I want you to start to find a little bit of a rocking motion, just a little sway kind of side to side. Eyes can stay closed if they're closed. This can be a small movement. You can let the movement get a little bit bigger. You might even start to add in a little front to back movement or circling your upper body around. So just finding a gentle little sway, continuing to breathe. Really noticing if you have any particular areas in your body that you might be holding on to any kind of stress, any tightness, any tension. Noticing those places that might need just a little bit of extra love and attention, a little bit of extra breath. And just filing that away as you continue to take inventory, go ahead and bring yourself back to center. Let your torso become still and then allow your head to drop over to your right. Left shoulder will stay nice and relaxed. You can reach the right ear towards the right shoulder. Maybe here, tilt your chin up and down. 
You can take your chin side to side, just releasing any tension that you might notice in the neck. And then gently coming up through center, and we'll just try that on the other side, letting your head drop over to the left. Right shoulder relaxes, left ear reaches for the left shoulder. Tilting the chin up and down, side to side, just adding in a little bit of movement that might feel good in your body. And then bringing your head back up to center. I want you to take your right hand now to the ground beside you. You can bring your palm flat or pitch up onto your fingertips. And then start to reach the left arm up to the sky and then bending over to your right. Just finding a nice side body stretch here. If you want to go a little further, you can kind of wiggle walk those right fingertips further out to the right side. You might even allow that right elbow to bend and allow your forearm to come down to the ground. And just bring in your awareness back to your breath. Deep breaths in, deep breaths out. Good, and then gently bringing yourself back up to center. Notice if you feel any kind of warm and tingling in your left hand. Go ahead and lower the left hand down to the left side and we'll switch sides here, reaching the right arm up and then stretching it over to the left. And then again, if you want a little more, wiggle walk those left fingertips out. Maybe come down to the left forearm. But just breathing here into the right side body, creating a little more space, a little more expansion with each inhale. And then really letting each exhale just be an opportunity or an invitation to release, to let go of what you no longer need. Good, and then gently work your way back up. Notice if you have any warm, um, anything going on in your left arm. And then when you're ready, just bringing your hands back to your lap. And I want you to lift your shoulders up towards your ears and then roll them down the back. And then do that again, maybe this time breathing in, lifting your shoulders up. And as you breathe out, roll them down your back. One more time, inhale, and exhale. Nice job. Now sliding your hands to the tops of your knees. You'll take a breath in and then let your hands slide back towards your hip creases. As you come into a little baby back bend here, lifting your heart. If it feels okay in your neck, you can drop your head back. And just feel your chest open up as your shoulders draw back. Good, and then as you exhale, allowing your hands to slide back to your knees. This time rounding through your spine, dropping your head down, so just giving the back of the neck a nice little stretch. And then once again, inhaling to slide the hands back towards the hips, lifting the heart, shoulders back, exhaling as you round your spine. One more time, inhale, and exhale. Good, and then bring yourself right back up to center. We'll come into a twist to the right, so right hand comes to the ground behind you, and again, you can prop yourself up onto fingertips if you'd like. Left hand will come over to that right knee, and I want you to take a breath in just to sit a little bit taller. And as you exhale, start to twist to your right, maybe taking your gaze past your right shoulder. Continue to anchor down through your seat. Let your chest be proud, but your shoulders relax. Take one more breath here. And then gently come back through center. And before we switch sides, you're going to take your hands out in front of you and start to walk yourself forward, coming into a fold, maybe dropping your head, or you can even like make a little headrest to put your forehead on with your hands if you want. 
And just dropping back into the sensations of your breath, the sensations of your body, trying to stay really present. So often the mind likes to wander into the future. Sometimes it gets stuck in the past. Yoga is a really great tool that we have to remain present, to be fully in the moment that is happening right here, right now. Good. So from here, start to ease your way back up. And then we'll set up for our twist going the opposite direction. So left hand comes back behind you. Right hand goes to that left knee, and as you breathe in, sit really tall. Let your chest lengthen upward, reach up through your crown. As you breathe out, maybe you twist a little deeper to the left, maybe taking your gaze beyond the left shoulder. Breathing in to continue sitting tall. Breathing out to really anchor down into your seat and then gently releasing to come back to center. And so just staying in that comfortable seat, we're gonna finish with a little bit of breath work and as we move into that, I want you to take your palms and just sort of rub them together, generating a little bit of friction energy here. Maybe starting to feel a little warmth between the palms. Continuing to rub, continuing to create that energy. Maybe you go a little bit faster. And then when you're ready, I want you to take those palms and just place them right over your face, not touching your face, but pretty close, and see if you can get a sense for the energy that you just created. Maybe it's a warmth, maybe it's a pulsing or a vibration. And then see if you could imagine that you could just gather up that warmth in your palms. And as you take one hand on your heart and the other hand on your belly, just bring it all into yourself. And then we'll practice an equal ratio breath. You'll breathe in and out through your nose, in for a count of four, and out for a count of four. So go ahead and empty out of any and all air that you may still have have in your lungs and then take a deep breath in for four, three, two, one, exhale, four, three, two, one. Good. Inhale, four, same thing, three, two, one, Exhale, four, three, two, one. Inhale, four, three, two, one. Exhale, four, three, two, one. And then allow your hands to rest back down in your lap. Maybe again turning the palms to face down just to keep that feeling of connection, of being grounded in this moment. And let your body just continue to breathe itself. Let go of the control of the breath. Just dropping back into the sensations of your inhales. And then the sensations of your exhales. Remembering that this breath is here to come back to anytime you need it today. You don't have to be on your yoga mat to practice breathing. It really is such an effective way to help us calm the nervous system in times of stress, in times of anxiety or fear. And so just a tool to file away in your back pocket to pull out whenever you need. your next inhale one more time reach your arms up this time both arms go up overhead and you'll bring your palms together and as you exhale draw your hands into your heart space pressing your thumbs into your chest see if you can get a sense for the beat of your heart 
And then we'll finish here with one more breath in. One more breath out. Know that the light and the love in me sees and honors the light and the love in you. Namaste.